See, now first there was a Mua Mua, right? Cigar shaped looking thing out in space. Now we have passengers filming a cigar shaped UFO in Italy. What's going on? Let's check it out. Jason Swing says he recorded video of a cigar shaped object flying right over Lake Norman. I've never seen anything like that before. It's just really, it's really crazy. Cigar shaped object mm -hmm. spotted last year could be an alien ship. The theory's out of this world, and the object may be too. Never seen anything like this in the solar system before. We get an estimate of its size at about 800 meters or half a kilometer in length. Roughly a cigar-like shape it was moving very fast, a little more than 195,000 miles per hour. Don't it seem like it's dropping? With all that's going on around the world, is it really hard to believe we're all alone? Today, we're looking into incredible captures that prove alien visitors are knocking on our doors. If you think cigar UFOs aren't real, take a look at this. A passenger captured this after the UFO's glint caught their eyes. And look at that. Isn't it exactly like a giant cigar? Check this out. It quickly shifts positions. Almost as if it isn't flying, but teleporting. Now try to explain that. And the second it comes closer, it appears transparent. I'm sure even our government has yet to replicate something like this. And then it goes out of view. Too bad we can't really investigate it. The English Stogie. This might just be the clearest visual of the cigar UFO you've ever seen. After multiple reports of the flying object, not only in the UK, but also Spain, one eager person finally managed to capture the UFO when it was zooming over his backyard. And thank heavens for his high quality camera, because just look at those details. Now we can finally debunk the idea that the cigar UFO was just clever editing. The cylindrical aircraft went on to fly for a few minutes more, eventually settling down by turning upright and beginning its descent. That's when the video cuts off. But I mean, come on, we've got enough evidence as is. I've never seen anything, I mean anything move like that. Like it was given the illusion as if it was dropping dropping down like it was about to land on something and go kaboom like it, that's what i got from that but i've never seen nothing move like that license exam a pilot captured this ufo streaking past him and it might just be the best ufo video you've ever seen the bright silver disc looked quite unbothered by the presence of the pilot maybe it didn't know it could be seen it seemed to be going toward the mountains until it took a sudden detour and headed directly under the plane as if to fool the pilot. Well, UFOs seem to be getting smarter. Space Cigar A decade ago, someone uploaded the video of a mysterious cylindrical object casually moving over Korosten in Ukraine. It was filmed by numerous bystanders, but only one visual managed to make it to the internet. Initially, a few theorized that it could be a small plane dragging along a banner, but the object seemed to be remarkably still, so the theory fell flat. It also seemed to be moving in a specific direction, like it was on a mission. Naturally, it leaves a lot to wonder. Maybe it was just a Russian aircraft patrolling the area. But who knows? Russian smoke. This might just be the most daunting cigar UFO video ever, because it's slowly staking out a Russian factory like it's not the intruder here. Well, if we think about it, it could be a really well-developed military aircraft. But simply sneaking into Russian territory is a feat not many have accomplished. But I'm still not ruling that out, though. Like, any type of military type of object or, or craft, spacecraft or something, drone maybe. I'm, not, I'm never saying I'm ruling that out. 
You know, we don't know what these things are. It seems something spotted the cigar UFO because it was quickly ushered out. And that's pretty nerve wracking because what are they doing in here that's so important that they'd willingly ice out a UFO? Picture perfect. Isn't this just about the most perfect UFO you've ever seen gliding over the clouds like it's no big deal? If it weren't for the plane passing by at that exact moment, it would have never been recorded. So at least we can thank the passenger. But let's talk about what it could be. It's certainly not a blimp or a balloon. And although it's a bit too oddly shaped like a stereotypical UFO, maybe it's proof that we really aren't alone in this world. Sorcerer's Saucer. After revelations about the existence of aliens, more and more pilots are sharing stories of aircraft and weird objects they've captured. And here's one video that's gonna blow your mind. This was allegedly filmed by a pilot, and before you wonder how it was captured, the camera was mounted on the fuselage. The UFO looked like it was inspecting the plane too, which explains how it was able to remain in the frame. But if we think about how fast that plane was traveling, it's quite impressive to see the UFO following suit. And then a sudden wave, something interrupting the scene, and it seems like the UFO distracted the camera to make a getaway. Tailed by aliens. If you think that was a UFO and you think it was studying, what do you think it's trying to obtain from us? Especially if their technology is alleged to be greater than ours, what are they studying our planes for? What are they gonna gain? It did it again! You saw it go invisible? You saw it? Believe it or not, that's really a UFO that was soaring in the sky as a lucky passenger captured it on camera. This happened in 2020 in Florida. And I think it's safe to say people didn't know what was going on because most of them were shut inside their homes due to the lockdown. It also explains why the video wasn't really taken seriously until just now. It cloaked itself. A few commented that it could be the Goodyear blimp on its voyage, but considering such travel expenses weren't really allowed that year, I'm feeling a bit suspicious. Escape attempt. Check out this rather perfect UFO trying to make a break for it, not realizing it's being recorded by a few people standing below. Many believe it's one of the many UFO sightings that were reported just this year in the US, while others think it's a hologram. But the way it quickly moves out of view, I don't think a hologram would last that long and still be visible from this distance. Spaced out. No, look at that. New Jersey residents recently captured a UFO hanging over a house. It seemed like it was scanning the neighborhood, and residents even noticed something bright emitting from its base. The UFO stood still over one house, during which it continued to shine brightly. I don't know, bro. After a few seconds, its light dimmed and the video cut short. Now, if we think about it, if it is a UFO, then what if the bright light was really some sort of door or hatch opening? Maybe the light meant that whatever was sitting inside the UFO wanted to explore Earth. Or maybe it dropped off something, or maybe it picked up something. Worse, mm. abduct one of us. Nebula's Journey. In 2009, a man claimed he'd seen a UFO cruising over Italian skies, but no one took him seriously until this video surfaced a decade later. The UFO was seen soaring slowly above, as if it was a lost tourist looking for a way back home. The UFO slowly glided out of view behind some trees, but luckily, whoever was holding that camera was really keen to capture its exit. So we see the UFO peeking from behind the branches and eventually carry on until... Whoa, where did it go? Well, its speedy exit is a clue of its extraterrestrial origin. Plus, if we look at the zoomed-in version, you can tell this isn't an aircraft that we've developed. Cosmic Overrun.
In 2013, a flight passenger flying over Atlanta recorded this small fleet of flashing orbs. And although it has been nearly a decade since it was first uploaded, the video has never been disproven. The trio were moving in a rather odd fashion. It was almost as if their flight pattern was pre-planned. Yep. A few people claimed it could be ball lightning, but that's an incredibly rare phenomena and doesn't look like this. Exactly, ball lightning is already rare. And then for you to have three in the same vicinity, come on now. Not saying it can't happen, but come on now. But this pattern, this, this formation, we've recognized and seen this before. What's that? It's also not a drone show because it was well over the clouds. In the end, it's just a UFO video that's been rattling us since it was uploaded. Flare Flight When a pilot shifts his focus from his plane to something bright floating past him, you know even he's having a hard time believing what he just captured. The flashy UFO quickly darted alongside the pilot, until it suddenly went up in the air. Probably heading back home. Now, we've debunked numerous UFO sightings, but this one is a true head-scratcher. The Mothership We've all heard of the Mothership, but has anyone ever seen it in real life? Uh -uh. A similar aircraft was recorded by a helicopter crew. And no matter how you look at it, it's clear this isn't some sort of man-made craft. Oh, this thing on film, whatever. Yeah. Let's assume for a moment that it was a blimp. Firstly, why would it glow like that? Secondly, a blimp would need to have impressive speed to be able to give a helicopter a run for its money. Of course, I'm always ready to point fingers at the government. I mean, they could be concocting some sort of secret airship that we don't really know about. But is it really that hard to imagine that there's life outside of Earth? Hungarian Asbestos Considering all the rage cylindrical UFOs are nowadays, you'll especially love this one seen cruising Hungarian skies. This video was captured in 2020 over Chobanka, thanks to a few drones exploring the village and some high-quality cameras installed for surveillance. The cigar UFO began its journey uphill and eventually continued its journey behind the cloud. Now, there are a few reasons why this isn't just a drone darting past. Firstly, the metallic tinge and shape suggests this object isn't just a lousy gadget. It's also not leaving behind a chemical trail, so we can cross out a man-made object. Lastly, it's changing angles at an impressive speed, so yes. it's definitely something capable of controlling its flight. A Burning Rage Mr. Alexa. The Popocatépetl volcano in Mexico is highly active, so it's always being monitored. And thanks to this tight surveillance, cameras captured a white cylindrical object darting past the volcano, and eventually... Going into the volcano. If that doesn't make y'all nervous, what do we have that we can send in directly into a volcano like that? What do we have? I don't know of anything we have that we could send in there like that. That should make us very nervous dive into its cone. This happened back in 2020, when most citizens were tucked up in their homes. And thank heavens for that, because the UFO's entrance apparently set off the volcano. Now, that's the main issue. Even if we get past the crazy theory that a UFO really did venture into Mexico, why on earth would it simply plummet itself into raging fire? Well, some believe it could have been a clever attempt by the U.S. to trigger the volcano. And if that's true, seems like they that's did a, a good, good job. It's a good point. Into the unknown. In 2008, citizens in Turkey reportedly captured a giant UFO flying overhead in Kumbergas, and one of them even managed to capture a closer look. Here's what they got. Well, I'll be. That's a UFO for sure. Now, of course, like most UFO sightings, this one had to be blurry, but we can easily make out the hull of that UFO. 
A little zoomed in, and you can even see the interior lit up. Although we can't tell what's inside, it's pretty easy to tell there's something. And that explains why it's sped out of view. Floating Obelisk. Alright, try to explain this one, because I've been scratching my head for a while here. This peculiar object was seen floating over the skies in New Zealand, and it's certainly bringing out a few conspiracy theories. Some say it could be a secret aircraft made by the government that is yet to be released. Others believe it's a giant drone, but sometimes things just don't have an explanation. This could be one of the few instances where you're seeing a glitch in the Matrix. Could be. <laughs> Aliens and Flight 370. In 2014, Malaysian Airlines Flight 370 set off to Beijing, but disappeared without a trace before it could complete its journey. A decade later, its mystery still stands, with a search spanning years finally coming to an end. But this crazy footage is giving us an idea no one had even imagined. This is the alleged Flight 370, and during its flight, it seemed to have encountered a bunch of flying orbs weirdly zooming over its tail. The plane continues its flight as if unaware of its fate, and just as it reaches for the clouds, a sudden zap, and it's gone. Many believe this could be proof that the entire flight was abducted by aliens. Well, it's certainly a scary theory. Dusting the air. Look, look, it's just floating. I, like, seriously. Check it out. Looks like someone forgot to tell this broom about gravity. <laughs> All right, now jokes aside, how is this even possible? I mean, technically, it's possible if the wind carried the broom high enough for it to get stuck in an air current. But there's one teeny tiny reason why this might not be the case. You see, it's pretty cloudy, but nothing else is rustling around. Not a single leaf moving. Hey, there's no wire, there's nothing it's connected to, it's... So the wind doesn't... I wouldn't even drive that way. Like, I'm turning around and going the other way and find me an alternative route to where I need to go. It doesn't require me to go this way. No, I'm, I'm going back. ...really seem to be acting out as it should. Uh -uh. Maybe it got carried uh -uh. away earlier and is just spending its time in limbo, stuck between dimensions. Uh -uh. Palm in the sky. Palm floating right in the middle of the air. All right, what type of sorcery is this? It's clear the branch broke off due to whatever reason, but that's not even the focus here. How on earth is it staying afloat? Now the obvious answer might be the wind. It could have gotten stuck in a cross breeze, but look behind it. Wow. Not a single leaf is swaying as hard as this one, so the wind might not be the culprit here. Maybe it's time we start believing whatever J.K. Rowling wrote about. It might not have been that far off from the truth. 90 Degree Plight You know things are getting crazy when pilots are revealing weird and unexplainable events. Like this video, where you can clearly see something cube-shaped flying across the plane. The pilot initially believed it was just a Mylar balloon that had gotten trapped in air currents. But with the altitude he was touching, that's not possible. When the video made it online, a few argued it could be some sort of an aircraft developed secretly by the government. It might have been accidentally captured during a test run. Painted Disc Check out this colorful UFO, seen somewhere in the United States. And it's certainly a looker. The UFO had a distinct ring, but you can make out something like a cube in its core. I wonder if that's the alien version of the cockpit. Maybe there's something sinister behind the wheel. The UFO broke into flashing lights a few times, which could be its way of communicating or signaling to similar aircrafts in the region. And it even seemed to settle down after its flight. But let's talk about why the government hasn't addressed this sighting yet. Probably because it might be involved and doesn't want us to know. 
Kenya Express. This bright object was captured in Kenya, and initially I thought it was one of those skydivers who uses flares to stand out, but something about its trajectory makes me think otherwise. It's also not a meteor because well, we'd hear about that on the news, so what could it be? Some believe it's part of a burning fuselage, but that still wouldn't explain its movements. Others joked it was a Super Saiyan. And honestly, I'd take that over some of the other theories. Floridian Fleet I don't know. Who would have expected to see an entire UFO fleet casually passing by? This happened just a few weeks ago in Florida and it's naturally freaking people out. Although it has been met with a fair share of disbelief. Most people believe this is just CGI or some clever editing. The reason? Well, we've barely seen one UFO this clear, but multiple? Now that would naturally bring some doubt. Plus, if it did happen for real, wouldn't that make the news? But at the same time, we've seen evidence of alien life. Now haven't we? Could it really be a fleet of alien visitors? Oh, what? what is going on? Clear as day. <laughs> I don't know. We see something like that. We might need to go underground, y'all. Seriously, we, we need to make we need to prepare, fam. What are we gonna do if we see a fleet? Well, would you look at that? This UFO took flight somewhere in Russia and managed to make it to the internet. Of course, being uploaded on a platform like that, it did receive a lot of attention. At first, most skeptical folks chalked it up to a drone that had been poorly designed to look like a UFO. But the more it took flight, the clearer it became that whatever this was, it didn't have any noticeable features like a whirring pair of blades or anything that would make it a man-made gadget. It also flew a bit too close to the ground, prompting many to wonder if the UFO had been damaged by something and was struggling to keep itself afloat. Russian Invader Imagine how unusual the sight has to be to freak out the Russians. This was captured by a couple of neighbors hanging out in their backyards. And let's just say, it stumped a few of them. <laughs> what began as a flare turned into an elaborate display of smoke and something white breaking the Russian airspace. It took a few seconds for whatever the mysterious object was to open up its arms, but it seemed to want to engulf the houses below. The group of neighbors did say they thought it was a UFO trying to signal other crafts in the area. I wouldn't even have thought extraterrestrial at first. I wouldn't have thought that at first. I would have thought that's some kind of a threat, though. That's been shot down. Well, I don't know what this is, but perhaps you do. Angular Flight A tourist in China captured something strange behind the clouds. Just the silhouette of something triangular, like a giant Dorito. But of course, it's not that. The triangular object was clearly stalking the area silently, like some type of predator. Or, as the tourist believes, a type of spyware that might have been sent by neighboring enemies. There are, of course, some who believe this UFO could be the creation of the Chinese government itself, meant to carefully record whatever is going on below without having to make itself obvious. Over the Horizon Man, what is that? Anybody tell me what that is? A boater noticed a fleet of bright lights casually flying over the North Carolina coast in the US. And although you'd be quick to debunk this as a group of flares, might I suggest holding off, because this could be something mysterious. We're in the middle of the ocean, on a ferry. Since the orbs were flying over the coast for a while and were pretty far off from the shore, it can't be just flares. They wouldn't last that long. It's also not some majestic airplane fleet. So why would it be flying so low? And wouldn't it be easy to prove? Well, who knows? 
Philippines demise. This site is so unusual, it became the talk of the town. Residents of the Philippines gathered to watch this spectacle as something weird and billowy emerged from the clouds, just like smoke coming out of a chimney. Initially, you'd think it's just another cloud, but since when do they move like that? <laughs> the residents were sure they'd caught a glimpse of an angel, presumably peeking out from behind the clouds to stay out of view. But a few others suggested just could be the way the sunlight and winds are interacting. And I don't consider myself a cloud watcher, but I've never seen a cloud do anything remotely close to that. That's all I'm saying. Passengers aboard a flight that set off from Denver noticed this peculiar plastic-like object floating just along them. They initially chalked it up to a sheet that might have gotten carried away by the wind. But within a few seconds, it took a different direction and appeared to turn completely flat, as if it was a flattened, sheet-thin metallic object zooming across the sky. Passengers were quick to notice how it managed to keep airborne along them, and it even seemed to be tailing them. It could be another plane, but this one was departing at 30,000 feet, and we all know how that works. Bright Orb A couple of months ago, passengers aboard a flight in the U.S. anonymously uploaded the video of an alleged glowing figure launching itself into space. The passengers firmly believe it could belong to some sort of UFO, but a few have claimed that it's just a rocket launch that was captured at the same time. But hold those horses, we haven't really decided anything yet. As far as I'm aware, most airspaces with rocket launches are typically restricted, especially for domestic flights. And even if it's a rocket launch, why would it hold its position like that? Oh my god! Maybe it is just an alien being departing in its aircraft. With all that's been going around, is it really that crazy? Evil Ring this really looks like the bottom of a spaceship about to land, doesn't it? Recorded by a Chinese man who'd gone out to do the groceries, this giant halo hung in the sky for quite a while, confusing citizens. They believed it was some sort of experimental aircraft designed by the CCP. But since it was out in the open, and the government didn't say anything, that theory hasn't really taken flight. A few believe it could be meteorological. And they standing too close for me, like too close from being like right up under it. That way, if it like opens up and starts pulling things into it, you right there within its path. No, I'm not getting up under it like that. No, we don't know what that is. Logical phenomena, but nothing of the sort had happened that day. Well, too bad we didn't really get an explanation for this one. Pyramid Pilot. A man was about to go out for errands when he noticed something triangular suspended in the sky. At first, he thought he'd just discovered a cloud with a rather peculiar shape, but the longer he recorded, the clearer it became that that object wasn't just a mass of mist. Now, we've gotten a few wild suggestions about what it could be. Maybe it's some sort of craft developed by one of Brazil's rivals that successfully managed to escape its radar. Or it could be an alien spaceship descending on Earth to check us all out. Kansas's Nightmare Another camera mounted on the fuselage captured something white darting across the plane. Thanks to the camera being motion censored, it was able to follow the UFO's movements and capture it in its entirety. Now, although we can't get a clearer picture than this, I don't like the way they're able to just fly freely through our airspace undetected. Just like they're just doing what they want. It could really be an alien visitor because 
How on earth would something else move so quickly and manage to go unnoticed by most of the passengers? <sighs> Staring in the mirror. Trust me, it's not moving. We wouldn't have passed it. This was captured by a passenger aboard a plane, and it really looks like one of them is stuck in another dimension. As confusing as it looks, this is simply due to a phenomena called the parallax effect, which is how you see objects moving at different speeds when you're moving. It's not moving. Close things seem to zoom by fast, while far objects barely seem to move. And sometimes, when two things are moving at the same speed in the same direction, it looks like the other one is just stuck in the air. Latex Discovery Campers noticed a blackish orb speeding across the sky and are convinced it's an alien spaceship. Now, I did look into it, and it's not the only sighting. Black round UFOs have been reported recently, which is raising alarm bells. But before you freak out, it's entirely possible it's just some sort of craft made by the government, fashioned purposefully to confuse people. Who knows, maybe it's just an elaborate ruse to sneak into enemy bases and monitor them without standing out. Ring of Doom. This black alien portal opened up over Disneyland, California, and naturally sparked fear in the visitors. This one brought the whole city out. You see all these people? The ring hung over the area for a couple of minutes until it finally dissolved. But we're left wondering, what is it? Well, it could be a smoke ring, probably made by one of those massive fireworks that Disney really loves. But if you've got other theories, I'm all ears. <laughs> Floating Spectre. This is the alleged sighting of Christ the Redeemer found floating over the sea. Honestly, it looks like some sort of a cloud, but it also seems to be rising up, so I'm a little on edge with this one. Perhaps it's a hologram? I mean, there's just a lot of possibilities behind this one. Floating creature. Look who's whizzing past this airplane. Seems to be an extraterrestrial visitor. Or maybe it's some sort of smoke demon that's casually stalking out its future victims. Honestly though, I haven't really found a good explanation behind this one. If you know what it might be, let me know in the comments, huh? <sighs> Flying creature. All right, you're not ready for this one. This peculiar creature was flying above Brazil when a few onlookers decided to record it. Now, at first, I was skeptical because it looks like someone wearing a suit wearing some sort of a jet. But since when have we perfected jetpacks, huh? The mystery figure floated around for a while, during which people tried to come up with a plausible theory. But Start shapeshifter, bro. That's a shapeshifter that high in the sky. It's shapeshifter. Then a sudden flame and it disappeared behind the mountains. That's a shapeshifter. Now that's something. That's a shapeshifter. Or been about. If you think portals aren't real, check again. This one just opened up somewhere on Earth and was luckily captured by a passenger aboard a flight. Now, before you go on raining on my parade, claiming it's just some sort of smoke ring, yeah, sure, that would be possible. Except it's standing out vertically and there doesn't seem to be any landmark that would cause such a thing. And then it even changes shape. Yeah, it looks like some things aren't just part of a wild imagination. And then it was moving like it got a pulse. Turkish Divinity Just as the sky rumbled, a crowd collected at a beach in Turkey, all eager to catch a glimpse of what they believe is an angel. The mystical creature was first seen on the water, which attracted beachgoers. But by the time cameras were whipped out, it spread its wings and soared into the sky. It disappeared between a space in the clouds, which most people believe was made purposefully for its exit. A fleeting moment. 
and something just flew by these military planes. So this just happened during the annual Fleet Week. Just as the jets were flying, something raced against them. For a split second, it would go unnoticed if it weren't for eagle-eyed observers who saw it. Well, if we think about how fast the jets were going, you'd have to agree that whatever this thing was, it's going at twice that speed and against the air. Whatever could this thing be? Okay, just wait for it. I'm watching Fox and something just flew by these military planes. Biblical abyss. <laughs> what? Check this out. This rather evangelical horror was recorded by a homeowner in the US and you can't really make anything out of it. You could argue that it's a bird carrying some sort of insect, but its size doesn't match, and it'd have to be a magical one to move that effortlessly without breaking its wings. And you can even tell a part of its shape. But even with a body, there's no eyes, no hands, just nothing but a void. Now this also looks like the jellyfish UFO. Many believe this is a biblically accurate angel. And if that's true, whoo, we better start praying. Creepy Ring. This blackish ring appeared in the middle of the sky above a housing society in Thailand. And despite it looking very much like a smoke ring, it's certainly something different. See, focus on the back of the ring. Although it looks like the wind is influencing some part of it and does make it look a bit smoky. Now this does look like a smoke ring. The reason why I say this one is because, did you see the birds? I always look to the animals to give me my confirmation, and they just flew past it like it wasn't nothing. Now, that still doesn't mean anything, but I would lean on the side of this may be a smoke ring because the birds wasn't scared of it at all. It almost looks like the ring has a small wisp-like tail that's helping it move. Maybe it's some type of creature, or caused by the atmosphere. What do you think? Weird Humanoid This floater was seen a few weeks ago, and since the video was uploaded anonymously, we can't really say where it happened. At first, I really thought it was some sort of a broken fuselage, or maybe something ejected from a rocket after a propulsion. But the more I look at it now, the more distinctly it looks like something... human. Only it's floating in the air, so of course it can't be one of us. The creature might be some type of alien visiting Earth, or could be a superhuman capable of flight. Either way, it's certainly not what I had on my bingo card. Islamabad's Mystery In 2022, residents in Islamabad, Pakistan, noticed something black and round floating in the air above them. Eager to record the spectacle, they pulled out their phones and captured this. The mysterious object was unidentifiable, so they knew they'd captured a UFO. The video spans for over 13 minutes, during which the UFO continued floating in the air. But eyewitnesses claim this went on for an hour or so, which is also why most people are sure this isn't just a drone, because it wouldn't have lasted that long at that altitude. Zoomed in, you could tell the UFO had a triangular shape, but just as witnesses focused on it, it simply disappeared from view. Pakistani UFO A team of pilots aboard a small PIA aircraft recorded a mysterious white orb close to them. Initially mistaken as the moon, the bright object had a slight trajectory. It was clear that orb was moving. Naturally, the passengers couldn't really capture it as a still, mm -hmm. since they were on the move. But the bright orb was moving fast enough to keep up with them. Although it's barely visible, if you can see, that orb has some sort of base. Which suggests it might just be a proper UFO. What do you think? <laughs> On February 18th, 2024, citizens in Lucca, Italy, reported seeing a cylindrical object floating in the sky. It managed to escape eyes until one lucky person finally captured it on camera. Dubbed the Cigar UFO, that object remained afloat over a building, 
prompting many to question its origins. <laughs> Some believe it could be the sign of an extraterrestrial visit, while others seriously think it could be some sort of spyware developed by the US, or even the Italian government. Well, who would believe something like that, huh? 